Sometimes, when you're editing in Darktable, you might want to select a specific area, like just this lap wing here, so that you can apply a module to it. Often, the best way is with a parametric mask. But in the parametric mask section, there are five different parameters, L, A, B, C, and H. How do you know which one to use? There's an easy way to see how each parameter separates your image. To do so, first open a module that you'd like to use with a parametric mask. Here, I'll be using the contrast equalizer. Open it up and click on the parametric mask tab. Click on any parameter and hover your mouse over the slider. Then press the C key on your keyboard. Darktable will then display a false color mask showing exactly how your image is separated. For example, in this lapwing shot, the A channel seems to work quite well, with the lapwing sitting in the magenta area. So let's use it. Hit the display mask button or press the M key and slowly exclude the cyan region. Done. By the way, you can also change the scale of the parameter to a log or zoomed scale by pressing the A key with your mouse over the slider. This will give finer control in the lower region of the scale. Anyway, once your mask is defined, feel free to apply any changes you like. Here, I'll just increase the contrast a little. I hope this video helped you with your parametric masking, but if it didn't, try taking perfect photographs.